I'm patting the wetness from the salted, slightly salted eggplant. See, they don't know that. The guys don't know well, that. Well, salt brings out the moisture, yep. and you want to make it a little more dense, right? By See, there's a lot of uh, people that think that eggplant is bitter. Um, and, you know, maybe during the season, maybe some of the soils, it could be bitter, guys. But here's the thing, what Martha was just talking about. You salt it. So you slice the eggplant. Right. And you salt the eggplant. And you see what it's doing? It brings all of that moisture, what she just said. It's the acid. It's the yeah. acid in the eggplant. So now you pat it dry. And, and this is going to sound crazy to you because now after we brush it with olive oil, now we're going to season it again. We're going to salt and pepper it again before we put it on the grill. Okay. Right, so Here. now we're going to put these on. And basically, there is nothing... This is like sort of a steak. This is like a steak of vegetable. Meaty, right? yeah. This, this could also be a mushroom cap, a giant portobello mushroom, right? Yes, absolutely. Mm -hmm. All right. So basically what we're going to do is once we do that, so you guys are with us. So we sliced the eggplant. We salted it. Five minutes, guys, you're going to see the moisture comes out. It just will beat up on top like that. Pat it dry. Eliminate some of that acidity. Olive oil, re-season it, a little salt and pepper. Now we're putting it on the grill, as Martha has done mm. there. And basically, once we once we do that... Is it hot enough? Yep. Let me, let me turn it up a little bit. Okay. So the other thing is, is that you don't want to have... Everybody has a tendency of just jacking the grill up to full blast. So, you know, maybe to get it, to get it hot, you want to do that. But that's... You, you want to use those controls. You know, medium... To medium high is a good zone. And you're not gonna get a lot of flare ups. And another little tip for you guys is this. You can easily get one of those spray bottles, you know, like a water spray bottle. Have it by your grill. Oh, I do that all the time. Don't you, right? Oh, yeah. It's a great tip that a lot of people don't know. You have it by your grill, you get these flare ups that start to happen. These guys know. They know, they yeah, know. of course they know. They know. They they're watch, all smiling, they're, they're, they know. They're, they watch they're, the show. They have flare ups all the time, Martha. <laughs> <laughs> They're good. Especially the fire guys. What's... <laughs> All right, okay, so, so now this... what we're going to do, we have peppers. They're going to do the same thing. Um, and they're really tasty. Oh. When, they're, when they're grilled or roasted, they're very, very tasty. So what we have here is just this, guys. Look, we have the roasted peppers. We have the grilled eggplant, the grilled peppers. Excuse me, I said roasted. And beautifully Beautifully grilled. done. Now, this is how simple to finish this, and you're going to look like a hero. You're going to go back and add a little bit of salt after they get out of the grill. Maybe a little bit of pepper. Martha, if you just give me a little, I have a combination of marjoram and basil. Oh. Big fancy word, marjoram. I mean, Isn't that same, basil, same as sort of oregano? That's correct. Mm. Yes. And then good olive oil. This is when you want to use the good olive oil, guys. How about, how about feta now? Yes, go okay. ahead. Oh, look so at that. Beautiful. Doesn't that look great? Yeah, it really does. Well, you like feta cheese, so, huh? Yeah, I like... <laughs> is that too much? No. no. And then olive oil, and then Martha, the last thing. Yes, very important. Lemon. Just a little lemon. The acidity in the lemon. You could use any citrus, but I like, for this combination, I like lemon. A little bit of lemon. Look what Martha's doing. Just a little bit of that fresh juice. That acid is just going to bring out all of those amazing flavors. And you know why I use this? What? Wait, let's I, tell yeah, them that. Yeah. I, use, I use this squeezer because it really gets all the juice out. And when lemons are costing like 99 cents each. No, look at this. Every, yes. every drop. Yes. <laughs> and you're not going to get it out by hand, even the strongest guys. No, you, guys. Won't, you won't do that. No, they won't. So okay. a little, and then that olive oil, that little perk like that, boom, mm. done.